Hello everyone, my name is Ryan Boyd and I'm here today along with my dog Digit to show you how to download Neo4j in about a minute. So first of all, we're going to visit neo4j.com and we're going to go to the home page of Neo4j. We're going to click on this link that says download Neo4j and we're presented with two different options. We're going to choose the community edition today. In the future, if you're looking for some greater production availability and scalability, you should look at the Enterprise Edition. It started to download and we're at 35 seconds. So we're going to go over here to our terminal and we're going to unzip this download and do that. And then we're going to simply run a binary that's included with the download. So in the bin directory, it's called Neo4j and we're going to say start. Passes some arguments to the JVM, and it starts our Neo4j server at 7474, and that was sort of a minute and three seconds. So we're going to visit, and we're going to spend another 50 seconds or so showing you how to use this Neo4j browser. We have some movie data uh, available in here as a tutorial, and this is data about a lot of movies uh, that were produced along with the actors that were in those movies. And we're creating all of that data right here in this tutorial. And then we're going to find some information from that data. So I'm going to look here and say something that's very graphy and say, give me uh, the, all the actors and movies that are up to four hops away from Kevin Bacon. And I'm going to modify this and just say two hops away from Kevin Bacon. And I'm going to run this query. And we can see those movies and actors and by default here, it shows the ID numbers of the movies and actors. And instead, we're going to show the titles of the movies and we're going to show the names of the actors. And it's been about two minutes and five seconds. And we've started Neo4j, downloaded it, started it, ran it on my machine um, and loaded some data in and performed a really interesting graph. For more information about Neo4j, visit neo4j.com. And I hope that you watch more of these videos in the future and reach out to my partner in crime and I, uh, Michael, and learn more about Neo4j. Thanks. Let us know how things go on Stack Overview.